Great stuff. I hope you enjoyed that. There's some fantastic knowledge in those modules. Please go back over everything that Kevin has said and do do the exercises. That tip that he has about four betting, when you hold the amount of chips in your hand or put the number in the slider and then ask yourself the question, will he fold 50% of the time? I, I think I've heard almost every bit of poker training out there. I've never heard that before. I've used it in my game since we did the interview. It really, really transforms your attitude to your preflop aggression and also the results you get. So just go and do it and experience it. And remember what Kevin said at the end. He had a brilliant point at the end of that where he said about not being born knowing how to do it. You know, Jake Cody, Kevin McPhee, all of these great players, they didn't, you know, enter poker knowing how to play incredibly aggressively or knowing how to dominate other players or knowing how to forebet. They learned through going out and doing it and not being afraid to try things. That's what I want for you. You'll get such quick progression if you go out and try these things in your game, especially those great tips from Kevin. I can't wait to hear the effect that that training has and the step change it makes in your pre-flop game, having it broken down like that for you. Uh, it's going to be fantastic to see the results that I know you're going to get. Now, next month is going to be at the same level and it's dealing with a topic that probably you've encountered but never thought about as much as you should because it's a huge part of the game. Next month's training is called How to Beat Up on Weak Players and Get Their Chips. Now, this may or may not strike you as the thing that will make the biggest difference, but actually this is a little secret that the pros have kind of kept to themselves and you don't really see them talking about anywhere else other than here. The secret is that almost all of the profit you make in poker comes from weak players and it's true even up in the higher stakes. You'll actually see higher stakes players congregating around bad players because they know this secret. It's the secret of winning at poker really. And that is you want to be playing against people that are not as good as you and if possible are way worse than you. Sounds so simple but people don't really do it and they don't really have a game plan to do it. So that's what this month is all about. It's about stopping you feeling unlucky. I know that sometimes a weak player is going to outdraw you but you wouldn't believe how many messages I get from frustrated players who have had a lot of outdraws against bad players and many even come to the conclusion they should move up in stakes so that that doesn't happen to them. Well, that's the wrong conclusion to come to. I understand why it happens, though. It happens because you're frustrated. You don't get the results you want. Well, this month, we're going to give you a game plan to get the results you want. We can teach you how to target weak players, how to spot what they're doing wrong, how to exploit them, and how to never leave a chip on the table. I promise you, if you implement what's in this month's training, you'll see a big, big result in your profits and also how you feel when you play against bad players. You're going to actually welcome them into your game because you've got that game plan that is going to punish their mistakes. It's going to be great. Can't wait to get to it. But before then, even more enjoyable is this month's training call. As ever, your opportunity to ask whatever questions you'd like in a live environment uh, on that training call about this month's training, about whatever's giving you a problem with the rest of the group. But if you've got questions that come up before that, as I'm sure you will have as you go through the modules or just generally hands that cause you a problem or anything else in poker, do get your questions in in advance. I want you to do that because I want you to get the help of the coaching and also it gives me a little bit more time before the call to think about the answer. It's really easy to do. You just go to your members area and click the button on the right hand side of the screen marked help. Uh, so leave a message there. I see all of those messages and I'll deal with it on the training call. If for any reason I can't do that, I'll message you independently at another time, but I'll make sure that your questions are covered off and answered. That's part of the point of being on this uh, program. So I'll email as usual to tell you when the call is. If you can't make it, then the recording will be available in the members area out with everything else in the program. And you can see how month by month this is building up into a library and a really, really valuable resource for you that's going to help you on your poker journey and give you that transformational effect as we go through the months together. So check out the training call recording, go back over these modules, ask whatever you need to ask. I will make sure I get to it for you. Until then, play good, run even better and go out there and four bet like a god. Take care and I'll talk to you very, very soon.